Sunda pangolin! Don't be fooled by their scaly, amylite plates. Pangolins are not reptiles, they're mammals. Their hard scales protect the pangolin from predators. When threatened, they curl into a ball to cover their soft underbelly. Whoa! Look at that pangolin hanging from the branch! It has a strong and flexible prehensile tail that allows them to grasp onto tree branches. Can you guess another use for the pangolin's tail? To ferry its young! Baby pangolins hitch a ride on their mother's tail as she forages on the forest floor or even up in the trees. As pangolins don't have teeth, they use their sticky tongues to slurp up ants and termites. Did I mention their tongues are extremely long? The base of its tongue goes as far back as the end of its sternum or the inside of its chest and measures about half their body length. To look for food, pangolins sometimes venture out of their forest homes and onto busy roads. Despite their hardy scales, being hit by a vehicle can be deadly. Injured pangolins are brought to the animal hospital in Mandai Wildlife Reserve and treated by vets. When the pangolin gets well, it's released back into the wild. However, a few rescued pangolins have a better chance of survival under human care and stay in night safari. Just like my friend Barani. His leg was badly hurt when he first arrived at the animal hospital and needed surgery. But with lots of care and practice, he could finally walk well again. Pangolins are critically endangered and we can do our part to protect them. You can remind your grown-ups to drive slowly and look out for crossing wildlife when driving near forested areas. Till next time, buddy!